I'm Abby Phillips for the Finance News Network. Don't miss Friday's webinar discussing base metals, consumer engagement strategies and metals and alloys technologies. You can register via the Share Cafe or f and website. Now let's take a look at the stocks of the hour. Parabellum Resources has announced that their assay results demonstrate strong rare earth oxide mineralization. In response, Chairman Mark Honan commented, We continue to be very impressed with the progress that has been achieved over the past 12 months with the metallurgical test work, resource modeling, engineering studies and pilot plant construction. Shares are trading 1% higher at 50 cents. AML3D enters the US defence industry with a large-scale sale of their manufacturing 3D printing system to support the US Navy. AML3D's CEO Ryan Miller said, This sale is a significant opportunity for AML3D as a part of its long-term strategic partnership with the US Navy helping them scale up submarine production with advanced additive manufacturing technology. Shares are trading 42.9% higher at 10 cents. Antisense Therapeutics has announced positive outcomes in the DMD Combination Therapy Animal Study. We spoke to Managing Director and CEO Mark Diamond about the news this morning. What we were able to show in the study that we conducted when we were using our drug H1102 that we've been developing for uh, Duchenne muscular dystrophy in combination with an existing class of drugs that are registered in the US for treating uh, Duchenne's, these drugs last year, sold in excess of a billion dollars annually, we we're able to show a significant improvement in the muscle function of these mice when we were using a combination of our drug with this class of drug versus just using those, uh, those drugs alone. So it's a very important initial observation. It does you know, suggest that the combination could improve on just using the single agent alone. You know, it's, a, it's an important uh, outcome, not only for the company, but we also think for, for boys with Duchenne muscular dystrophy. So, yeah, nice to be in a position to talk to this positive data today. Shares are trading 17.1% higher at 9.6 cents.